there is a question I get all the time. People ask me, they send uh, messages to me uh, on different kind of forums and Facebook and whatever. They ask me, I want to buy my first kayak, which kayak should I choose? And that is a very hard question to answer because I don't know what kind of kayaking you like to do. Do you like to take day trips, longer trips, uh, maybe go kayak camping for a week or two? Uh, you want to paddle just in calm, closed waters, uh, rivers, slow river, rivers? Or you want to play in waves? Maybe you like to learn how to roll and uh, do all these cool, cool rolling you see people do? So you first have to think about what kind of kayaking you want to do and uh, after that you go to a kayak rental you rent a kayak tell the people there what kind of kayak you like to have and try it out don't go for a too wide too stable kayak it's that one will soon get boring you will be slow it will be hard to turn and uh, yeah you you will get bored of that kind of kayak so have a kayak that is a little bit challenging for you you feel a little bit unstable and it you will quickly feel okay in it uh, and you will progress your skills much faster then you can uh, join a kayak club or take a kayak course for kayak paddling and try out different kayaks until you know what kind you want there you can try out kayaks that are a little bit challenging for you and you're improving your skills and you know more and better what kind of kayak you really want and then try to buy a second-hand kayak the first time if it's possible to buy something similar to what you like to have you can, if you get tired of it after one or two seasons, sell it for more or less the same price you bought it. There is a big demand for kayaks today, and especially second-hand kayaks. So uh, I've sold a lot of my kayaks, uh, and uh, uh, I know some friends that bought second-hand kayaks, and they've sold them after one or two years for even a higher price than they bought them for. So that is a good suggestion. Start with the second hand. Don't go to the closest uh, dealer and buy the cheapest kayak they have. Uh, it's not worth it. Even if it's very cheap, it's not worth it. It's the quality is not there. Uh, a kayak can cost from thousand dollars. That is about ten thousand Swedish kroners and upwards. If it's below that, it's usually not that good. And if you like this video, uh, please hit subscribe and the like button below. Uh, it will really help me. And uh, I will be encouraged to make more videos like this one. So, okay. I hope this was something uh, useful for you. And... Uh, I hope to see you out on the water and enjoy your kayaking experience. Okay, bye bye, see you again.